So you kind of see here an evolution of a bunch of our different labels. You know, we intentionally sought out the, riff, the roughest, thickest paper uh, to use because we wanted it to feel very rustic but more wine-like. Our original bottled beers are Shelter Pale Ale, Chicory Stout, and Immort Ale. If you can imagine in 1995, leading with beers that were 11% alcohol, made with maple syrup, juniper berries, chicory, coffee, licorice. Um, so uh, there weren't any breweries really focused on using culinary ingredients 20 years ago, and that's kind of our, has been our raison d'etre uh, since one, day one. It's also interesting when you come in and see some of these old bottles, you see very varying fill heights. Uh, back in the day, we had a piece of shit East German soda bottle filler that uh, at the end of a bottling run we'd lay out all the cases on the ground and pick through them and take the 13 ounce fills and the 11 ounce fills and mix them in with the 12 ounce fills so that every six pack averaged 12 ounces per bottle. Uh, so we were kind of all over the map. Down here you can see uh, some of the bigger bottles that we uh, uh, started doing uh, in the late 90s. You know, we, I, I hand stamped every bottle of 120 minute. Uh, the first year, we, we, which was 2003, I guess, that we started doing uh, 120 minute in bottles. Um, and then you got beers like I, I painted the Noble Rot bottle, the Festina Lente, and the Namaste uh, labels. Soon it was cool that once we could afford other artists, uh, I still enjoy doing painting projects occasionally, but it's a lot of fun to bring um, other amazing artists into our design world, and this exhibit certainly features some world-class artists uh, that we've been lucky enough uh, to brew with. Um, I think they're also going to feature the original bottles of Shelter Chicory and Immort were actually metal embossed, really, really beautiful. They cost 10 times as much per label uh, as the eventual ones without the metal embossing. Uh, Shelter Pale, as I travel around the country, interestingly enough, we're known as an off-center brewery, but that's a beer that uh, more and more people are asking us to revive. We still do it occasionally in uh, draft, uh, but who knows, maybe Shelter Pale Ale will we'll see a, 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 a resurgence uh, someday in our, in our future. We invite you to come check out this exhibit at the Lewis Historical Society. Cheers.